as the tribe emerges from the dark wet. Hey, A.B., I want to do the bing, bing. Hi, everybody. This is A.B. from the Fat Fat Guy channel. Hey, 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 no, no, none of that on my channel, buddy. You can't do that here. Hey, no, fuck you. You don't tell me what we're going to do here. This is my movie. I'm going to make this. No, 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 no. This is my channel. This is accidental broadcast. If you want to do your fuck fuck guy stuff, you go do it on your channel. Hey, fuck you, the guy. I don't tell you. We're going to make that solicit the movie on the other channel. No, I'm trying to talk to the tribe right now. I'm going to do an Athena update video. The bike's not running. Hey, you fuck, you get that bike running. I need for my movie, too. You're going to make this like that. How are you going to do that? That's to have the bike run. It's not running right now. There's nothing I can do about it. The bike is down. They go down. There's mechanical issues. Hey, you fuck, you should have get the Chinese motorcycles. are so much better than, the, you know, you got the Japanese motorcycle. That's a piece of shit. Hey, don't say that. That's kind of racist, don't you think? No, fuck the Japanese people. My girlfriend's Japanese. That's so inappropriate. Well, whatever, AB. You're going to make this story like this? I got to tell the people right now. They got to come watch that fat, fat guy. It's the best movie ever. It's not a movie. It's like videos on a website, a video sharing website. No, it's the movie. Got the red carpet and everything. We're going to make it a very good people. Got the star shining. We're going to be the Brad Pitt. He's going to he call me this morning. Brad Pitt called you this morning? Yeah, he want to make the appearance, the cameo. Does he even ride motorcycles or have anything to do with that at all? No, he called me on my cell phone. I got the Galaxy Note S4. It's the iPhone edition. It's so good. Galaxy S4 iPhone edition, really? Yeah, it's the special one. All the company, they all call me up. They say, hey, AB, we got the special phone. We're going to make everything to mash up in one phone. Really? Yeah, the Siri, she talked to the robot, everything is so good. Nobody likes to talk to me like this. I tell you, that's a very true story. I don't like Mina Walk, I don't make up the story. I don't know, AB. I think he's been rubbing off on you a little iPhone Galaxy S4. Uh, it doesn't sound like it. Hey, fuck you, you're gonna make the bring in the intro already. Oh, AB! What is happening, tribe? Sorry about that little intro thing with AB. Seems like everywhere I go, there he is. Ah, you know what, I forgot to say, in the very beginning of this video, I meant to say thank you to all you um, tribe members on Facebook. I posted a, um, a donation link and people donated, so I'm very grateful for that. That's going to help out a lot because that was one of the things that was really preventing me from taking it to a um, professional mechanic. I have limited mechanical skills with bikes. Mostly I don't have the right tools and stuff I got to get deep into the bike. But thank you guys very much. Um, and if anyone else wants to donate, I'll put a link below. If not, cool. But if you do, it'll definitely go to good use. As I don't know how deep into the bike I'm going to have to go right now. So the story, if you guys don't know it, is I came home one night, bike was running fine, next morning it wasn't running. Battery just kept turning over. <laughs> Nothing, no ignition. I pulled the spark plug out, spark's firing, I pulled the uh, starter off, Kurt came over, I switched his starter with my starter, maybe it was a starter, maybe it wasn't pumping, up, pumping out enough juice. Uh, that wasn't the problem. Uh, everything seems fine. A lot of you guys are saying valves, which I think might actually, that could be it. So we pulled the um, valve cover off. The timing looked fine. Top dead center was fine. The uh, timing chain seemed nice and tight. That thing's got a really robust, um, I think it's an automatic chain tensioner or that variable chain tensioner it's not like you manually adjust the chain so that was fine uh, what else uh, all my switches people are saying maybe it's the switches I've already disabled all the switches so the clutch switch the kickstand switch that's all that's all been disabled for a long time and when those are disabled I don't think it even sparks which it is doing I took the spark plug out put it down on the exhaust it's sparking like hell I don't know, kind of thinking it could be the valves. One thing is that 
prior to the um, starter issue and the bike going down a couple of weeks ago, for a few weeks it was making this sound kind of like this like bah, 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 tah, 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 this internal sound and it would do that upon startup for 10 or 15 seconds and then it would quiet but it would still be there and I didn't even really notice it I guess it came on it started happening so slowly but I rode Kurt's bike once and I was like whoa it doesn't make that sound at all same motor right they should be both quiet so that could have been one of the valves starting to I guess fall out of time I don't know much about valves but somebody else had said that the uh, I think it was Mr. Duff factor um, that once the coating on those titanium valves or whatever those valves are once that coating wears away it goes from like sealing and working to just a quick diminishing reality very quickly so that could be it um, maybe the exhaust valve isn't sealing all the way then the, the starter was, and here's the in, one of the intermittent problems, the starter was turning over, turning, 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 and then somewhere in the middle of that, it would turn and then stop. So we took everything off, I cranked the motor by hand down right through the um, stator case, and it would turn over, or it would reach top dead center and it would get stuck again until I would turn the starter and go, and lock up again and then it just stopped doing that and it went back to the starter just turning fine so if it was one of the valves that it's coming and running up against in the uh, when it's hitting top dead center wouldn't that repeat itself every time you try to do it I don't know it seems like it would I'm gonna make another video on this but the man, the bike is it's kind of reaching that point where 26,000 miles, I don't know how much longer I can continue to keep the motor running well, which is kind of frustrating because I view this bike kind of as a production tool, you know, I want to uh, consistently make videos. Anyways, more on that later, but so for now it's Tuesday, it's, mid, it's midday right now, I'm going to take the bike down to... Uh, it's got Derek's house tonight at 7, and I think we're going to start tearing into it tonight. I'm not sure. I already have the I already have the side covers off. Everything's pretty much off. It. You can get to the valve cover pretty simply. Um, but yeah, that's about it for now. I'll, I'll keep you guys posted on the bike. And thank you for putting up with my other videos that I've been doing, like regular vlogs and stuff. I don't know. I think they're kind of fun. Uh... Yeah, so I guess this video's over. What should we dive into? Should we just dive into my face? Skydive? Speedometer dive? How about just a good old fashioned I love you dive? <laughs> <laughs>